A circular queue has been implemented using a singly linked list where each node consists of a value and a single pointer pointing to the next node. We maintain extra exactly two external pointers front and rear pointing to the front node and the rear node of the queue. Which of the following statements is or are correct for such a circular queue so that insertion and deletion operations can be performed in O1 time. 1. Next pointer of the front node points to the rear node. 2. Next point of the rear node points to the front node. So in this question, this is a question from data structures regarding circular queues. In the question, they have given us two implementation of a circular queue and then we need to find out in which of the implementation insertion and deletion both can happen in O1 time. So let's look at the first one. Here, next pointer of the front node points to the rear node. So this is the circular queue which I have implemented here. Let us say there are four nodes in the queue. This is the front node and the next pointer of the front node points to the rear node. This is the rear node. Okay. So next pointer of this one points to the rear node. That is node 4. Meaning next node, next pointer of the rear node will point to this one. Next pointer of this one will point to this. Next pointer of this one will point to 1 actually. I put the arrow wrong here. So this is how the queue would look. Now let us try inserting or deleting. In a circular queue, insertions will happen at the rear node and deletions will happen from the front node. Okay. So for insertion, we will need to create a new node. Now we already know the rear node's address. So for this node, the next pointer, I can put it straight to this node. And then the front node, I need to point to the rear node, right? So this will become the new rear. And from the front node, I know the address of the node which I created just now. So this arrow, I will just put it here okay so this is how insertions happen clearly i did that in o1 time so this is insertions now let us try deleting from here now deletions should happen from the front node so what i should do is i should delete this node make this one as the front node and then this should point to the rear node now after deleting for making this as a front node, I need to know the address of this one. But in the current front node, only the next address of rear is stored. In rear, the next address of this is stored. So in order to reach the address of this one, node 2, from front I need to go to rear and I need to traverse like this and I should reach the second node. There is no way to directly get the address of this node. Meaning for deletion, I can't do it in O1 time. It will take O N time for deletion. If I delete this one to get the address of the next one which should be the front node, I need to start from rear and reach here. So this can't do deletions in O1 time. In the question they are asking, insertion and deletion operations can be performed in O1 time. So this we can't do that. Now we will look at statement 2. Next pointer of the rear node points to the front node. So this is that implementation. Again we have four nodes here. This is the rear node, this is the front node. Next point of the rear node points to the front node, meaning next point of the front node will point to node 2, this will point to node 3, this will point to node 4, etc. Now let us try inserting an element here. Insertion should happen at the rear node. So I will create a new node. I know the rear node. From here, this pointer I will make it to this one. And this I will make the rear node, new rear node. And from this node, I need to point to the front node. Front node address also I know, so I can directly put an arrow here. So this is how we can do insertions. Clearly insertions can happen in O1 time. Now let us try deletion. Deletion should happen at the front of the queue. So this node I have to delete. After deleting this node, I need to make this node as the front node. And from the rear node, I need to point to the second node. Okay. So. Clearly in the front node I have stored the address of the second node using this pointer. So this one's address I have directly from the front node. So this I will just directly make as front. Now this one's address I know. Rear I will point it directly to this node. And then after that I can delete this node. So clearly in this one deletion also can happen in O1 time. So in implementation 2 insertion and deletion both happens in O1 time. So this one satisfies the criteria of the question. Now there were four options given, one only, two only, both one and two, neither one nor two. So two only is the correct answer, B is the right answer.